Hello, my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. Today I am reviewing this new eye palette from Beauty Bakery and it is called the Neapolitan Ice Cream Palette. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream! So with that being said, we are going to get started. Look at this lovely palette. It has so many beautiful colors and that's what helped me achieve this eye look today. Here we go. Since we last spoke um, about the Beauty Bakery, I have done or I purchased this new eye palette here and we're going to do some swatches. However, um, for one of the followers on my YouTube channel, we um, I had done these little reviews last time and she said she was hoping for a swatch test to see if they smeared. So what I did right before I <clears throat> excuse me, video the intro, I went ahead and set those different colors on my arm to give it a moment to set just like you would your eyeshadow and then we're going to do a smear test. Also since we last were together I purchased a few more lippies and I wanted to give you all a swatch test on those along with a swatch test on this eye palette. So we're just swatching it up today. With that being said, um, I have these and they should have set up. It hasn't been but a few seconds. And so we're going to swatch this way. And you notice they don't carry over. So we'll swatch this way. And we just have a light carry on this purple here. But the rest of them do not smudge. So um, I hope this swatch test helped um, that other... YouTuber that wanted to see how they did. So those actually set up very nice and do not move. So let me try to, in fact, <clears throat> I'm trying to get these off my arm for my YouTuber who was asking about swatch test. These are not exactly coming off easy for me to be able to do some more swatching, which is a good sign. In fact, I'll go ahead and use my other arm for the lip swatches because my arm's now, again, it's not coming off. Okay, so I hope that answered the swatch test or the smear test for my fellow YouTubers. Now let's look at the lippies. So I have five lippies in front of me and I'm missing a sixth. I think it's still in my purse because I carry it with me wherever I go. That's how much I love the Beauty Bakery. Okay, this little lip whip is called French Toast. Who doesn't love some French toast? Okay, so here we go. A little French Toast action in the morning. That is just a nice peachy co color. Um, great and neutral. Absolutely love it. I wish that I had my purse near me so that we could swatch the sixth one. This one here is called Fortune Cookie. Oh my gosh, I love Fortune Cookies. Those things taste amazing. And here we have just a, it's a slight bit darker than the French Toast, but again, a beautiful neutral. We're going to darken it up a tad. And you probably have already seen Ginger Snap because there's um, a couple YouTubers out there that have used Ginger Snap. And that's just, oh, look at that color. <clears throat> All of these just make you want to eat them, and it's not just because of their name. Okay, then we have S'mores Devores. Gotta love these names. Gotta love them. Okay, so S'mores Devores is a nice brown. And wow, look at me not be able to swatch a straight line. <laughs> But that is a nice brown color. So I love the s'mores divorce. Um, and I really wish I had that last one. Okay, so this lip whip is called Rosy Posy. And this is one of their metallics. The other one that I have in my purse is a metallic also because I love me some metallics and shine. And look at that really pretty rose color. It is absolutely stunning. So these lip whips, man, if you put these things on, they last. They 
dry down good. They're not, they don't leave my lips tacky. Um, and they stay on throughout the day. So again, I'm still trying to get off some of this. So if scrubbing my arm to try to get off some of the eye product is any indication how these babies last, you're going to love them. All right, let's talk about the Neapolitan um, ice cream palette. So you heard me say in the review, I didn't understand why the colors were what they were. I felt like some of the colors were not in the right spot for their name. However, I did buy this myself from Beauty Bakery. So I don't know if I just got a weird one or if they ended up having some weird names. Not sure. So I think my skin has died down in color a little bit. So we can do some swatching here. We have chocolate chip, which is white. Okay, so these names don't make sense to me. And ice cream, which I used. And those are just two nice light shimmery colors. Next, we are going to use the powdered sugar and the vanilla bean. And we're going to go right next to these two here. And I'm really applying a light finger, so it's these colors are going on good. Um, you heard in my tutorial, my only complaint, so to speak, was that when I didn't use um, an eye primer, they didn't last all day. Um, I had to touch them up around 2 or 3 in the afternoon. Okay, so now we have wafer and pistachio. And again, I'm using a light finger. Just stunning, stunning colors. Okay, we are going to go with drive through and sliced almonds. Which again, I don't know why pink is called sliced almonds. I need to get over these names. And the sliced almonds really compared to what it looks like in the pan did not show up very well. Sorry about that feedback on the light. Um, so that one is not as pigmented as what it looks like in the pan. The other ones have been a dream, so we're not going to judge, not going to judge. Next, we are going to do strawberry and cocoa. And we'll find a spot somewhere on my arm. So good colors there. And finally, we will swatch You Scream and Sunday Fun Day. And we're going to use my lippy arm. And again, those are just some really nice colors that swatch very well. So, what are my thoughts on, the, on Beauty Bakery? I absolutely love Beauty Bakery. Um, I think the products are, are good. And I am hoping today, now that I used an eye primer, to see that the eyeshadow that I put on will last all through the day without touching up. And see, okay, back to my swatch test. Um, those babies aren't coming off. So that gives you a real indication about how serious these lippies are. Like, they have, they got staying power, ladies. Staying power. Men, if you like these lippies, buddy, these are for you. These things do not smudge off. Oh my gosh, I've got to own them all. That's it. That's my goal. We're going to own every, every Beauty Bakery lippy. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and swatch test. Y'all have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, make it a beautiful day. Till next time.